Hello everybody, welcome back. My name is John Fillmore, as you probably know by now. And this is actually a mall. Let's see if I can actually show you there. See? Multiple floors and things like that. And, wouldn't you know it, it's the Pokemon Center. Now, of course, I'm not here randomly. I actually went looking for this, uh, this particular place. Um, and, you know what, I, I, I it, it's gonna, you know what, it seems awesome. I'm, you know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna shut up now, and I'm, I'm pretty much just gonna be there, um, in about five minutes, and I'll see you then, right? Okay, so, we're here. I'm just gonna give you kind of a look at the background. So this is the Pokemon City Mega, apparently, at Tokyo. Nice Mega Charizard, it's a Mega Ch uh, Charizard. X in that one. Now, of course, it's all in Japanese, but definitely awesome. So, let's take a look. Oh, it even has a music. It even has music. That's awesome. Alright, so, let's see. Really? Really? There are Pikachu in Mega Gyarados. Not known as in... There's Pikachu in Gyarados costume. How is this even... Whatever, you know? Ooh. Ooh, let's see if I can find um, let's see if I can find a core core. What is oh look, they must come out this uh, this one. That's interesting. Okay. Not really one for Pokemon Rangers, but definitely uh, something of interest. Definitely something of interest. Alright, so as you can see, tons and I mean tons of merchandise. It's just it's everywhere. And it It's a shiny man. Magikarp. Okay, that is awesome. They actually have actual music playing in the background. That is... That's a, that's a nice touch. That's a really nice touch. Really? Look at that. Okay, okay, so apparently Pikachu is everywhere. No, it's Pikachu in, a, in an Entei costume. What is this? What is it? Alright, whatever. Okay, and huge! Hu actually, absolutely huge! Pikachus with a Pokeball as a bomb? Oh look, a Mega Deontay. Mega Shiny Deontay. Alright. Event. Interesting, okay. Ooh! Okay, I'm gonna walk over here. Actually, you know what? Let's do a nice shot from the inside. Unfortunately, I didn't actually bring my game with me. I would have loved to, but I mean, would have been too much. And here we actually have some other Pokemon players that are actually my age or even older, which is awesome! It's absolutely awesome. Alright. Oh, look! Sceptiles in, uh, in Pokemon tournaments. See it. Let me see. Let me see. Okay. Okay. Pretty much every mega you can possibly think of. Are these hats? Oh, these are costumes. Okay. So pretty much every mega you can possibly think of, Pikachu's in one of those costumes. It's Mega Sableye, Mega Charizards, or Mega Charizards, Mega Lucario's. Ooh. Okay. Oh look, Ash Green Ninja. Okay, so this one, this one just came out. Oh, there we go. This one was released uh, a little while ago. I'm not quite sure. What is this? It seems to be a case. Although I might be wrong. I may be wrong. I don't know. I don't. I don't really read Japanese. So Ooh, that is a nice design. That is a really nice design. This is actually from the X uh, series. Actually from X. Yeah. Golden, the Golden Luxe Ray. Now, I know the uh, Cora Cora actually came out. Uh, not, actually, not even uh, that long ago. It should be, hopefully, should be able to be found here. A whole bunch of cards over here. With including, I don't even know what that is. Oh, there, there you are, there you are. Get the camera kind of settled in on it. Hold on, see if I can get a sharp picture. There we go, much better. 
Is that a... No, it's an Aerodactyl. Okay. Got on Kyogre. That's it's cool. It's cool. Okay, so here's kind of a way of showing how you actually play it. Delphox. Oh, right. Okay, so... Hold on. Okay, so this you actually have in here. Pretty much life-size versions of the Mega, uh, Lucario and Mega Mewtwo Y. Personally, I like Mega Mewtwo Y a little bit better, but hey, that's just me. That's just me. Um, oh, come on. Focus. There we go. Whoop. So you have cards. You have... Um, well, that's Xerneas and Yveltal, but... Not quite sure. Oh, look. Golden... Gold... Golden Golduck and uh, Golden Moivum. I don't know. I don't know what they mean, but alright, whatever. <coughs> golden cards. I don't know. I don't know what it means, though. I don't know. Now, let's see what this is. Okay, so the Astro Ninja came out. Let's see. Anything new in there? Cannot find anything new. Okay, the Mega Diancy, Mega Shangle Diancy, which makes sense because, you know, this is a nice place to get. Ooh! Okay, if you ever want to have a nice, good one of these, here's the place to buy it because you have literally every single Pokemon from which here can be found. I want to actually see if I can find one of my favorite Megas in here. Maybe I can find Sylvia, but hey, we'll see. We'll see. Pokedex is nice. Oh, look! Ooh, look. Dude, nice. You got Hoopa and Shiny... There we go. A Shiny Rayquaza. Dude, I'd buy that just for the Shiny Rayquaza. I love Shiny Rayquaza. I do have one. They actually distributed them. I do have one. They are awesome. There's a Mega Ring with Mega Stones. I'm wondering, do you guys know all of them? I certainly don't. They're probably from the original ones. Let's see. What else? What else? You have paper, you have pens, blah, blah, blah. Oh, this is uh, this is champion's um, uh, tune, I suppose. Yeah. Oh, okay, that's cool. That that's cool. That is really cool. That's cool. There we go. They actually played this. Oh, here, let me move on. They actually played this during um, the uh, the Masters uh, final. Oh, dude, look at this. Uh, sorry, they actually played this during the Masters um, final uh, in uh, singles and doubles. This is the tune they play to. So that's cool. Oh, it's Mew. I love Mew. I really do. I really love Mew. So you got all these guys in here. Okay, so you have... Okay, so that's pretty rare, actually. These are plushies, actually, of a lot of the Megas, and also some of these uh, legendaries, including Xerneas, uh, Unbounded Goopa, a couple of the starters here, uh, Shiny Genesect right there, another Goopa, Goopa Unbounded, Venusaur, uh, you got Sylvia right there. There we go. Um... Tyrants. We love things. Okay, dude. Woohoo! Wow! They got everything here. Uh, okay, uh, I'm gonna need to actually stop right now because uh, I'm gonna probably, you know, nerd out and it's gonna, you know, spill all over the floor and it's gonna be, it's gonna be messy. Uh, so I'm gonna do that before you guys all see that. And that's, yeah, I'm thinking that's probably gonna cut it for now. Um, so I'm probably gonna see you guys when find something else. I'm not quite sure what that is. I might actually head to the Origami Center next when I'm finished here, which is going to take a while. Um, but once I'm done, I'm probably going to go there. So, I'll see. Alright? So, um, other than that, yeah, I think that's pretty much it. So, I'll see you guys later. Right? Bye. Hello, everybody. Alright. Uh, I'm still kind of at the Pokemon Center. Well, that's the Pokemon Center right there. Uh, I'm kind of outside of it. But, I found an interesting uh, thing that I kind of want to spend some time on. 
Okay, so, let me see. You see this? Okay, so those are actually uh, arcade games. I'm not quite sure what or how they work. Um, but pretty much what you do is this. You actually, uh, in here, in the Pokemon Center, you buy particular, um, like, cards, right? They're like square little chips or something like that. I don't know. Uh, you can put them in these games. And the game that registers which Pokemon is actually, you know, you're fighting against. And then you can actually battle with the Pokemon that you actually bought. You know how cool that is? That's genius. Why didn't we think of that? Well, okay, this is Nintendo, and it's mostly based off uh, on um, uh, Japan. This is, well, I'm pretty sure you know what this is by now. This is, um, uh, this is a Pokemon tournament. Uh, so pretty much this is a way of saying, oh yeah, uh, we're fighting against, well, Pokemon, but then kind of in an um, actual fighting style. Oh, whoa. yeah, Mega Mewtwo, or uh, Mewtwo, or Shadow Mewtwo, there we go. Shadow Mewtwo is actually really good. That's Shadow Mewtwo X. Pokemon tournaments. So yeah, Shadow Mewtwo X was actually rec uh, recently released, uh, or at least, you know, leaked, or whatever, shown. Um, what is, I think, new is that Sceptile and its mega form are actually now uh, in uh, Pokemon tournaments. Um, so let's take a look at the things that you can actually choose from. So you have uh, Lucario, Pikachu, Lizardon, uh, Suicune, uh, Gengar, Sir, uh, Sir Knight, uh, Manula and Kairiki? I don't know, I can't tell. But I'm guessing, well, these are the, uh, the Japanese names, so they're, they're translated a little bit. Um, but I, I think you guys all know what they are. So, so anyway, I kind of want to show you guys that, you know, just as a little bit of like, oh, okay, that's kind of cool. Uh, and, um, yeah, I suppose uh, next time I'll uh, see you with something different. All right, be right back. Hey guys, uh, right now I'm kind of just walking through the mall, um, there's a uh, Pokemon Center again. Oh yeah, it's so cool, I'm so happy, I'm so, I'm so happy I went there. I mean, you don't really see this very often in America where you get to see like an entire store, not even an entire store, like three, four stores combined just for Pokemon. I mean, it's so cool! Uh, Ah, uh, I love it, I love it. So, uh, right now we're kind of just going to go, you know what, just go for a walk. I mean, eh, what, else, what else are you going to do? I got about 15 minutes until I need to start kind of sort of heading back to where uh, I need to be. But, uh, we still have time, we still have, uh, we still have like 15 minutes or so. So we're just going to go uh, walk through the, um, uh, through the mall, kind of see what, uh, what we can find. So, um, oh yeah, so apparently uh, this mall is well known for its presence of their, 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 of, of uh, the Pokemon Center. There are actually a few of them scattered throughout uh, Tokyo. The smallest one is actually located under uh, Tokyo Station, the center of Tokyo Station. Um, the biggest one is here, and that's why I also went to this one, because it's, well, the biggest one. There should be a couple of other ones as well, but I decided to go on this one because, you know, what the hate. Uh, let me see. Uh, other than that, uh, this pretty much includes everything you can buy over there. Now, I did try to find a Kurokuro, but I couldn't actually find one. I have been looking for them, um, but apparently, I, I don't know. I, I, I suppose I'll, I may just need to look it up online and be like, okay, what is, uh, well, where can I find them, or what is it? What has been released? Uh, that's probably what I'm actually gonna do. If I have to. Uh, let's go down. There we go. No, that's actually up. Wrong escalator. Um, so I'll probably kind of look at what um, I'm gonna do um, with that because I do actually want to give that uh, a proper. Uh, look through, especially if it includes any information regarding uh, Pokemon Z or any, you know, anything else for that matter. Um, and I, I, 
I, I am 99% certain that there will be a, um, a Pokemon Z coming out. Maybe not next year or something. I mean, um, Nintendo kind of... Uh, either they've already decided and they've released it in, uh, in uh, Pokemon or in uh, Korokoro, uh, but they still need to do something for the uh, 20th, 20th? Yeah, 20th anniversary uh, of Pokemon since it did start in 1996 uh, with uh, red and green in Japan and then it moved to red and blue uh, and later yellow uh, in the States. Now, that being said, uh, it is uh, then about 20 years old and they need to do something about that. And there's been a lot of, well, discussion about, okay, what the heck are they going to do? And to be quite honest, I have no idea. There we go, it's a little better. I have no idea. Oh, look, it's Disney. Eh, she's not Disney. Um, so, I don't know. I don't know what they're going to do. But they're definitely going to do something, so we'll see what they do. Uh, which, I mean, if they haven't released it in the, you know, if they haven't released it or going to release it very soon, then they might actually want to, you know, start thinking about that because that's actually kind of a, a good thing to do, you know, marketing-wise. Um, because, you know, get the people excited uh, for whatever is coming. And it better be good because I'm excited. And it's the 20th anniversary. I mean, come on. You've got to count for something. Okay, here we are again at this. Now, you can't actually enter there. Um, or there, that particular place. Um... But I, I must admit, it's a nice arrangement. It's a nice arrangement. Just because, you know, it's... I don't know. It's just, it's just nice, I suppose. It's nice. Um, actually, you know, I'm going to go this way. I think it's actually going to go a little small. Because I did see something, uh, and I want to go check it out. In case it actually is something that I want to see. It's like uh, something for anime and uh, things like that. And I do actually like anime. Not that much. I don't really watch it all that much. I don't think go for manga. Uh, but um, it is uh, it is still uh, kind of nice to see all these uh, things, especially you know, some of the things that you have uh, interest in or have seen. Um, I have read through the entirety of um, Full Metal Alchemist. That was uh, my absolute favorite, or at least, well, actually my first. Um, I have seen the first season of Sword Art Online. Um, I'm Currently, I kind of stopped. I'm currently working through the Tsubasa Chronicles. Um, I, I, I like it. I like it. But, so, I, I don't know. I don't do that much, but it is of interest. So, so that being said... Uh, oh, that's cute. That's cute. Hold on a second. See that? Right, 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 right there. Right there. Right. Hold on. Where's finger? Right, right there. Yeah, right there. That's actually um, a Pokemon symbol. So there's pretty much this entire mall was filled with, uh, to the brim with uh, Pokemon references. Awesome. Okay. So anyway, I'm gonna shut this one off, and I will see you when I have something uh, of interest. Hey guys, welcome back. Uh, so I am back at Tokyo Station. It's that one, right there, actually. Um, I'm kind of waiting for my brother to be back. Uh, but in the meantime, I'm just gonna uh, kind of show. Um, what Tokyo is in sort of the night time. Now, if you can see, it's about, it's a, uh, well, dawn, no, it's about sunset. The sun has set, um, but we still have a tiny bit of light left. Uh, so that's nice. And you kind of can see a little bit what it looks like. Now, this is, of course, the financial uh, district, you know. Um, over there is the um, Imperial uh, Palace. Again, we didn't actually go in there, um, but it was kind of nice. Um, well, to, you know, outside, it was kind of nice. Um, other than that, I mean, it's just, it's kind of the financial um, part to get the moon up there. Um, so it's not as, oh, sorry about that. It's not as lively, I suppose, as, um, well, I don't know, some other places uh, in Tokyo, but it's a lot more, it, it, it has some grandeur, and that's kind of nice to see about Tokyo as well, so, anyway, so this concludes, uh, day two, so tomorrow we're actually going to Kyoto, if I'm correct, uh, but don't quote me on that, but anyway, I'll tell you about that, uh, tomorrow, alright, so, I'll see you then, bye!